My name is Scott Williams and I'm the founder and director of Innocrete 3D. We are using a 3D printing technology with an eco-friendly mortar to print insane geometries and products for several sectors, including interior design, exterior design, landscaping, gardening, construction, and subsea also. The material is non-toxic, so we can use it to print artificial reefs and seawalls. We have a predetermined mix that comes in from our partners and they are called Saibi. Uh, they're based in the Netherlands and we get the material pre-mixed and pre-bagged. We then uh, dose that into our machine. So we're kind of doing one bag a minute. Um, and then we add water and a retarder to slow the um, set time down on the print. We have three people in the print team today, but it depends how involved and how complicated your print is. So we're printing for about 45 minutes. The planter to the right on the screen there is um, roughly 15 minutes. And then the wall to your, to your left on the screen is um, yeah, 30 minutes print. Yeah, so we keep on we keep an eye on the temperature. So um, today we had the roller door open, so the humidity is creeping in and creeping up. Um, so we have to keep an eye on our water levels and all of our um, mixing levels. And also, as we build higher, the machine needs to create more pressure to push the material up into the robot arm and up higher, printing up towards um, two and a half meters today. So we we really need to provide pressure to get that that material up the hose. The one, the, the planter to your right is the, um, like a decorative sort of landscaping ant pot for the gardens. Um, and you can see it's got really nice overhangs and geometries. Each layer builds up on itself and we can offset those layers um, left or right uh, five or six mil. And we like to push the material to its absolute limits. So today we pushed it to six mil, which is kind of uh, 25 degrees um, offset. And then the wall to your left is actually an internal wall that we are using to um, build our own toilet and kitchen in a true fashion. We've just printed in our eco-friendly mortar. The material has got a really, really um, rapid onset cure rate um, so that it can build layer on layer. So we now need to leave these prints for up to, up to seven days before we can move them. Um, but of course, the smaller pot here, we can move this the next day. Um, and really, truly, we could move this wall here if we if we wanted to push the material to its limits again. We could perhaps move it in four days or so, but we can let it cure, get our our uh, setting over where it, where it's actually going to, you know, sit in situ. We can get that prepared and then get the wall moved across. Our ethos is: you think it, we print it. This wall here is um, up to two point five meters tall, and it took about thirty minutes to print. Now, after it's um, five to seven days cure and we can put this into place 